So first off, we have a, well, I mean, how would you describe it? This is what a design. Yeah, I'll get that out of there. Um, <laughs> I'm talking about the designer, I guess. But if you can see here, this is um, just how many toilets this, are here? Oh, d there's got to be like a hundred in there or something. Yeah. There's a lot. And this is probably some kind of military barracks or something. Because yeah, I don't like see where, where else this is. Or it could be a factory. You know, I've seen... I. It could be a factory. I saw a factory before where it was like this, but there wasn't toilets. It was just a trench. Yeah. Oh, no. Trench is I've, more common. I, I saw just a this trench. This is luxury. Yeah. Now... For those of you who don't know, these are squat toilets. Yeah. And the way that they're lined up, you would this have is to... not training for the human centipede. Stop. <laughs> Stop. I, I actually just want to point out that if people were using this, because obviously you, a bunch of people are supposed to use it at the same time, why would you have 100 toilets? Are those cameras up in the I corner? I honestly want to say no, but I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, maybe it's lights. Let's just say they're lights for yeah, now. they're lights. But here's the thing. People would have to stand single file yeah you would have to stand behind someone and you'd have to be crouching down taking and a turd and watching somebody taking a turd in front of you you would actually see turd come out this is horrible this is a nightmare this is a dream for some people <laughs> yeah i mean it's possible germans yeah <laughs> maybe some japanese who knows. Yeah. But I just got to tell you guys, no, quite it's seriously. Something about X's power. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's true. This is a night. This is a nightmare for anyone. It's a crap okay. Congo if, line. If <laughs> crap Congo line, guys. Okay, seriously. <laughs> anyone who cares about privacy and personal space, this is their nightmare. Can you imagine? Uh, you know what I want? What I want to be the only guy in there. Okay. I just want to experience And then like that. hop from one. I'm not, it doesn't matter what I do. I just want to be the only one yeah. in this pa palatial mansion. Mm -hmm. You know, I want to be Crouching Tiger Hidden shit. Yeah. You know, the only dude. Ugh. Yeah, that's 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 pretty nasty. I, I'd like to hope that it's not always in full capacity. You saw it here first capacity. on the China show. What's that? I would like to hope it's not always in full capacity. Well, there's no reason why they would have that many unless it was necessary to that's have true. that That's true. It's many like, people. now is the time. Hey, hey, forced labor workers, it's time. But that's honestly how it works. There's probably yeah. shifts, you know? No, yeah. So it's either military or factory. Well, it's why, it's why some factories in China put uh, toilets in the ca uh, cameras in the toilets. Yeah, so people don't waste time. Yeah, because they want to, the boss needs to be able to check in and be like, oh, they're just hanging out on their phone. Yeah. Right? They've already been in there. Some of them have timers, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Um, so this is not this is par for the course. Yeah. And yeah, like like you said, the trough is actually much less humane. Like yeah. the trough is bad, and the ammonia smell is yeah, insane. Yeah, it's I'm one of the like, yeah. traumatized by the trough. I it's one of the things that sh shocked me about China. Yes. It's one of the first times I went there, and you yeah. know <laughs> the reason I was going there is to take a look at factories. Yeah. That were making um, security cameras, and one of the factories I asked to use the bathroom, and they told me to go there. The and trough. It was like a trough yeah. for just the workers to all just like. Yeah. I've been was, in a trough. It was like this, but it was just a long trough. I have told this before, mm. but I, there was a trough situation one time at a bus stop, mm. and it was so apocalyptic. And you, it wasn't just me that couldn't handle it. Like people that walked in literally were coming out like with tears and stuff <laughs> yeah, because yeah. the ammonia was so bad, bad because yeah. it hadn't been cleaned. Yeah, and yeah. it's just, there's hundreds, if not thousands of people every 10 minutes going in there. Yeah. Because remember, this is like a capacity for a hundred thousand customers in this bus station in yeah, Dongguan yeah. or something, right? Sure. And when you went in there, there was the, a giant, giant trough, but people couldn't even go and wait their turn because they couldn't handle to breathe. So some people were just pissing on the wall and then running out. Yeah. Like holding their mouth. Like this. Well, I mean, yeah, would you blame him? But again, the lack of privacy in the bathrooms is wild. It's not just the trough. Remember, we've told this before, but I was in this town and I walked in and it was a trough like this lengthwise and yeah. people shitting in it. Some dudes squatting there. Yeah. You know, bits out. Sure. Shitting while reading the newspaper. One guy was on a Game Boy. Yeah, it's interesting. And I had no choice but mm -hmm. to shit next to these people. It's, yeah, it's interesting. There's no barrier. Yeah, now for those of you out there, of course, China's a big place. Yeah, it's yeah, varied. You also get very nice, clean, high-tech toilets in certain areas, especially shills like to go to them yes, to show them. There's very like, rare. There's like one that they yeah. go show all the time. But of course, if you're in a tourist area... Um, you're going to see a nice toilet. If you're in a five-star hotel, yeah, yeah. you're going to see a nice, decent toilet. If you're in a shopping mall, you're going to see a nice toilet. Somebody said, so, somebody said, where's the toilet paper? 
Well, no, there is none. You don't. There is no toilet paper. Yeah, in China. You, they you don't. And we've actually made a whole video about yeah. that on ADV China. You can take a look. But the the be all and the end all, the TLDR is that people steal the toilet paper. Yeah. So old they ladies, don't. Yeah. So they don't put toilet paper, paper, and you have to carry tissues around with yes. you. And something you learn very quickly in China. Yeah. This is a little bit of humor, guys. Um, and this is food related humor that's been going around China. Yeah, it's a trend right now about food fails. Yes. So anything food fail related, there's been a yeah. lot of clips going around. So, so this guy has cracked a bottle of Mao Tai, which, which is, is a strong alcohol. It's Baijiu. Yeah, and it's it's you know hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So he had broken it, and he's very sad. So he's uh, taking yeah. advantage of the <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> Don't pretend like you haven't been there. Oh, we've all been there. <laughs> nice. <laughs> a lot of food fails this week for some reason. It's been a thing. It has. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Oh, pause that. This is actually a little cultural anomaly. Okay. So, this is called Kao Manto or Kao, yeah. kao Mianbao. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Kao Mian Bao is a, like a toast that you grill, yeah. but you'll only find this up north. And yeah. it was crazy. Like I got used to, when I lived up north, I got used to being able to get some lamb skewers, yeah. some beef meatballs, yeah. some beer, and then I would uh, toast some bread. And yeah. it was just a thing that you do. And then when I went down south, I never found it again. But they have manto, which yes, is but like it's made out of rice. Bread's better. Yeah, for sure. You know, but is, I used to it. Is that real bread or is it's that, real that bread. sweet bread? No, it's real bread. It's real bread. It's real bread. Okay. It's not good bread. No. <laughs> but it's real bread. Okay. Yeah, good it's, stuff. it's savory. Yeah, there there are some very big differences between the north yeah, and the big south. Time. Eh? Yeah. Big time. Yeah. I've even had a garlic bread. <laughs> oh, <laughs> there's there's a, an ice cream cake. Ling Dango is an yeah. ice cream cake. I think they thought it was a normal cake. Yes, <laughs> yes, I think so too. Oh, I'm going to eat it. Oh, I'm going to eat it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Shake, shake. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty funny. The Let me get us out of here so, yeah. like, we're probably block blocking some of the action here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> guantou. How do you say yeah. guantou? Like jarred fruit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they oh, spiked, spiked the, the, the straw <laughs> all the way through. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> so Yeah。哦,我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真的是。我真